Hey guys, welcome back to another Python fun super video for you guys. We've got the one and only. We're making a chatbot today. I'm going to walk you through the steps on how to make a beautiful chatbot on how you get to yourself have, well, someone to communicate to you digitally, even when no friends are available. And it's gonna be super funny with it telling you funny jokes, yes or no answers, and most of all, a fortune? Okay, my brother was cracking up when he heard that. Speaking of my brother, where is he? Adi, come on! Adi, come on, the camera is waiting for you! He's here! Weren't you cracking up yesterday after we were playing the game? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and he's gonna ask some questions to, to um, whatever our chatbot's called. You can name it whatever you want. I named it someone, but he's gonna ask some questions and who knows? Maybe he'll deliver the um, right answer. Okay, and our chatbot is going to be pretty simple using all the concepts we've done before with conditionals, strings, lists, and inputs, and much more. I think you're ready and I'm ready. Adi, cut to the cube. Let's dive in. So, well, this is my chatbot I was talking about. I'm saying, my chatbot is super fun, and I named him, Drumroll Lando. And so, I have three options he does. Type one, if you want to ask him a yes or no question. Two, if you want to hear, of course, a joke. And then three, three, if you want to know your fortune. fortune. So let's run it. And I have dun, 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 my dear Trester here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So now, Adi, here are the options. Which one do you want to do? I do one. Uh, oh, Adi wants to ask Randy a question. Let's see. Is Abby a cow? Adi, <laughs> Randy, help me. <clears throat> What? <laughs> Rando, our friendship is breaking. <laughs> okay, next. Let's one. ask one more question for the one. Is Abby a gorilla? Rando, you're going to break my friendship. <laughs> Rando! <laughs> Abby, what's next? To number two, to ask Randall, do I more, please? A joke! Oopsies, I forgot to type in two. <laughs> what did the fish say when he swam into a wall? Damn! See, do you understand? Because dams and he swam into a wall, damn! Ha ha ha, very funny. <laughs> yeah, very, very, very funny. Let's do another joke. What do you call a can opener that does not work? Do you have a guess? No. A can't opener. Oh, ha ha ha. Very, very funny. funny. Very funny. It's very, very funny. Okay, <laughs> number three. Okay. Number three. If you want to know your fortune. Okay. Now, Adi, what do you want to do next? For the, the fortune. Okay, he wants to see his fortune. Ready? Random's prediction of your fortune today. You have a 0 0.0000000000001% chance of winning the Powerball. Woohoo! I don't know what the Powerball is. It's something where you can win $1.6 billion. Yes, yes, yes! Uh, do it. 
Okay, let's see what Rando says again. <laughs> let's hope he doesn't say that again. <laughs> yeah. Happiness is on its way to you. Wait a second. Listen. It says you might win the Powerball. And it said happiness is on its way. So I can poke your nose. No. That means you won't win the Powerball. I know that. Yeah. You probably ain't going to get a ticket to win. Oh, yeah. I didn't think about that. Okay. So, now, I'm going to teach my friends how to do the code. Okay, guys. I hope you enjoyed Rando in the chat bot. So, now let me show you how to do your own. Okay. Let's dive into the code. Okay, so for, so what we're going to do first is you guys all remember how to import a library. If you guys don't remember, a library is a code that you can use in your program. I'll explain you line by line of my code to show you how I did it. Okay, so the first line of code is from random import star. We are importing the package random and all the libraries within that package. First, I'm introducing my chatbot with some print statements. I'm using a multi-line print statement, which means three quotes. I hope you remember this from previous classes. Okay, so I made a, so what I did is I said, welcome to the legendary fun chatbot to start it off. And then I went to the next line and said, my name is, and I chose Randall. You can do anything. It can be anything you want. Okay? And then I wrote in the next line, type one to ask a yes or no question. Two, if you want to hear a joke. And three, if you want to know your fortune. That's what I said in the intro. And what I did is that I made three lists. Okay, I created three variables and I made them as lists. And basically, the first one is for yes and no. So it was a small list, just yes and no, basically. Number two is full of jokes. And number three is fortunes. These are three lists of strings. Next, I asked for the user's input. Do you remember the input function is used to capture the user input? Great job if you remembered. You're capturing the user input into the user choice variable. Okay, now to end it off, I wrote three if statements. Remember conditionals? Well, if is the main one. So what I did is if user underscore choice, which is the, the variable that has the user input, is one, then I'm going to put an input that says type your question enter, which I'm saying it through the input. And when they click enter, I'm going to print, Rando says, I'm gonna put a comma outside, so I'm gonna put Rando says in a string, and a comma outside of the quotes. And remember, that's how you join two things in a string. I'm joining this string and the choice list one, which is the output. Choice is a function in the random package that, well, basically, it picks a random item from a list. What I'm taking, say, pick a random item from list one which is yes and no. And I'm asking it to print it. So Rando says, colon, and then comma, choice list one. Basically, it's gonna say yes or no. That's how when Ahab Adi said he's Abi a cow, it for some reason said yes. Okay, for the next one, for jokes, I said, if the user choice is equal to two and remember it's double equal signs double equals is used to compare and single equals is used to assign okay it's equal to equal to two and then i'm going to simply print uh, the choice from jokes list and then for number three i'm going to print print um is equal to equal to three print randall's prediction of your fortune today comma choice fortune list 
So now it picks a random item from the fortune list, which I have above over here. So now I made it very simple in 10 minutes to play with my brother. But you guys can make it more complicated and make it looped, which would make it continue keep on going over and over again until you want to stop. Okay guys, now that we finished, I, this is how I did it really simply because I wanted to play with my brother. But I have three challenges to you to make this a super game. And maybe you can even share it on Ripple. So, number one, to make this into a big loop and to when the person clicks exit, dead only you stop. Number two, what you have to do is, well, you gotta make sure that if the user enters an invalid option, your bot, in my case, Randall, will say, well, that is an invalid option. You have only three options. These are the three options. And then it will say the three options. I hope you guys um, had fun today, enjoyed today's episode, and interacting with Randall. Okay, guys, three, two, one, we're out!